Thanks, L.L. Bean, for sponsoring today's video. All right, y'all. What's up? Welcome back to another vlog. So today we're actually uh, we're going on a hike, and the cool thing about this hike, guess where it is? That's amazing. It is right up the street from the house. Not far at all. Like I didn't even know this was here. Bro, like... we got whole mountains around us. <laughs> yeah, we. Um, I knew about where we are, but never got to hike any of the trails. So that's no. what we're gonna do today. Um, so the gone. kids are already up ahead. So we finna get going. Yeah. This is cool. Huh? Oh, this is a hike hike. This is a whole hike. Uh, I know we done hiked some trails. These are these are more trails, like for real. We made it to a lookout point. Hmm? I can see a house. Yeah, you can see a house right there. I don't have to move my hand. You can kind of see a house, like, right there. It's crazy. Yeah. yeah, this is nice. Y'all see that? Breathtaking. Got the kids over there. They're chilling. If y'all see them. They're laying down on the rock. They're tired. So we end up uh, walking the trail. But once we got up here, we're like, okay, we're just going to walk along this way because it's not as bumpy and rocky. It's nice we're actually able to get our workout in today. Oh, yeah. Thanks to these clothes we got on from L.L. Bean. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this this winter, it seems like we're actually having a winter time. Usually it's all hot. Um, now it's cool. And usually it when it's cool, is. I'm an indoor person. Yeah but with the right clothes on you're good yeah we have on the right clothing and i have on my hat because it is breezy out here surprisingly it's pretty cold out normally like curtis said it doesn't get colder until later on in the year but having on the right clothing makes a difference and ella bean has everything you need whether it's fall summer winter time and these clothes are the best clothes especially when it comes to family so if you need something for the whole family yeah ella bean has you covered yep and if you want to get outdoors <laughs> this is the right stuff to have oh, yeah. on you guys know we love being outside in nature we love being outdoors and this is just great that we get to wear some comfortable clothing the kids all have on their little cute jackets huh <laughs> yeah but it's great feels the awesome ones, out here the other ones are asleep yeah they're tired y'all know I love being outside and even the one now you know she loves being outside too person. it's something about getting out that even if you've been cooped up getting outside it's like a whole new reset especially like just for your mental health <laughs> your physical health it is good all around like we've been slacking a little bit we're working out and being able to do a family workout together is awesome and just being able to get out the house because i'm not going to lie especially you know after the year we had being cooped up you need to get out and get that fresh air so with the holidays coming up it's awesome to go ahead and start shopping and ella bean has your family covered especially for all those outdoor activities that you guys may be doing like camping s'mores hiking hiking just like all the things yeah whatever you want to do outside especially in the winter time so ella bean is going to be great just so you guys can stay warm all on the inside and also make a stronger connection when you're outside which we are doing now oh man i'm loving it so remember guys whenever y'all head outside ella bean's got you covered now we're going to enjoy the rest of this view and then we're going to head over to the house to give y'all an update on yeah. what all's going on over there okay. all right y'all what's up so we're back at our house we want to give y'all an update we got some things happening tomorrow so we figured we would update y'all yeah first we'll start um you want to tell them about what we got going on all right guys here? so you know we have a lot of trees a lot of land and whatnot but whenever we first moved here or <laughs> i'm ready to be here whenever they started building we already had our driveway so since we already had our driveway that means yeah. you had a lot of and stuff. And that's this right yeah, here. Yeah, this right here. So that means we had a lot of areas cleared that we wouldn't have normally want it cleared just because we want really want a lot of privacy. And originally I did want the house like far back into the woods, but the way our land is, we would have had a problem like with flooding. So we decided, okay, we'll put the house where it is, but we're gonna go ahead and instead of waiting until the house is finished and having the landscape come out, we're gonna go ahead and have them I think now that the electricity company has come out, they've already put down what they put down. Yeah, yep. Yeah, so let me hop in. <laughs> you better hop part. in because I'm going to yeah. tell it all. Yeah, that's right. Um, that's an update too. So, yeah. electricians, they've came, and the good thing is they want to tear down a whole lot more trees. Oh. But our builder was like, no, 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 no. You're not tearing down anything else. 
So we were wondering what these markers were. We we're wondering what the markers were here. And they go through the woods too. They actually already have it set up for temporary power. So yeah, they cleared as much as they needed to for the electricity. We're supposed to have temporary power, I think this week. So I don't know what that means. And then we got some, got some electricity on the way. All right, all right, we'll make sure I'm in there. Oh. All right, so our driveway would look a little longer if we would have had the trees lined like we originally wanted, like how, almost like how our neighbors is. But since we can't have that, well, since we didn't have that, we're gonna go ahead and put that so we can have. So yeah, we, we're supposed to meet with the landscaper now. It makes sense. Uh, we're gonna meet with them after the power company got done doing their yeah. stuff. So hopefully, maybe we'll set up the meeting next hopefully week. Hopefully this week coming up. Yeah. Or next, within, well, we're gonna within be out the of next, town the f next week. Well, not till that end of the, the following week. week. The so hopefully this week or next week, we'll meet with the landscaper to discuss that. And um, those are the big things as far as, by the road, that's our, that's our action. Well, yeah. We actually got stuff happening in the house. Yeah, let's go show you. All right, so I think let's... we showed you guys some of the stuff from the previous vlog, but they've done a little bit more. Like I think they finished the caulking and whatnot, and we're just gonna kind of walk through the house again just because it's been a minute and I like walking through it. I'm not sure what we told you guys, so we're gonna tell you guys all over again because I can't remember what we put in the last vlog, but we're gonna, I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys are always ask for updates anyway, so you're not gonna mind. We have the windows, we have all of the board and batten up. We do not have the beams, and I don't think, I think we're gonna have wood going across where the beams are, but we don't have that either. Um, we don't have our metal roofing. Yep, now that might get done this week. That might get done, they said that might get done this week. So let's come Because they said once they finish all the siding, yeah. then they were gonna put on the metal roof. So they're probably gonna put the siding, paint, and then probably put that roof on. Oh yeah. All right, well let's come over this way. Let's see, be careful for the mud. Let's see the size of the house now. You see, we're going to have a little light up there. You can see it. We're going to have a light there. We're going to have a light right there. I'm not sure what light fixtures yet. That's still the biggest thing that I have to do. I have to have all this to her tomorrow. I want to have it like, here, this is what we want. So, Curtis. Don't be asleep. Don't be looking at I me. I was awake last night. Okay. So, all night you've been asleep, and then you wake up after when it's time to go to bed. No, we ain't picking out stuff then. But hopefully, yeah, we'll, we should be. We should have time tonight to pick out some stuff. Right. I've been, I've been ready. <laughs> we was looking at clothes too. Yeah. So, see, they did all the caulking, or as yeah. much as they could do. There's a few spots on the other side where they got to finish putting up the. Uh, Board and the, Yeah, these are the battens. They got to finish putting those up, and then they should be ready for paint. Like I said, we have a meeting tomorrow with them. Uh, we got we still got to talk about because they still have the um, the line for an electric oven instead of the gas one. Yeah. So we want to make sure they switch that. But the good thing is we already talked to the neighbors. They have the same plan as us. They're like, yeah. look, we gotta we gotta thicken, thicken up our up, property line. Thicken that property line up, and so, our property line gets pretty close to there. So I yeah. was like, we so have a lot of that. So if they're gonna thicken up right there, yeah. I'm probably just gonna let them thicken up right there, and I'll help if we need some extra trees. At I'm that probably gonna put some line. extra. But yeah, they already said they're gonna put some, which is great. Yeah, so I'm. I glad mean, I kind of like the little pathway, but if we can like at least. Yeah, and we just need to block it right. Block there. it, and then have just like where you can walk through just a little. Uh -huh. But I wouldn't want to block our path. Yeah, it's I'll like we can have like there. a sitting area or something. Yep, I don't exactly. know. Exactly, something you don't know. Something cool, some lights. Oh, that's what I really want. Yeah, a little fire pit right there. That would be cool. Mm-hmm. Um, here, the nice thing is, oh, did y'all see? Well, if not, <laughs> check out. Y'all didn't see the back porch last time. I didn't record the back porch. We showed the front porch. The back porch. Look at all this bead board up. This oh is. Oh my gosh. This yeah. is nice. They they did fix all of the. Uh, they got the ceiling fans in the right spot. Mm -hmm. They got our can lights up. And we have all the windows in the house. Is the big thing mm -hmm. because Tuesday they're supposed to start putting in insulation on the inside. I guess they'll have the inspector probably come out Monday. They probably have to do that beforehand. Yeah, I don't know. Things have been getting pushed back, so I mean, we're understandable yeah. with it. But you didn't say this is our seating area. So this is where me and yeah. Curtis will be enjoying. So this is where me and Curtis will be enjoying our, like, coffee in the morning and just mm -hmm. sitting outside um, enjoying each other. I'm probably going to have me, like, a uh, like a coffee maker outside already preset. Oh, yeah. Is that a cable for TV? A TV out here or something? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I didn't know we asked for that, but that's pretty cool. Yeah, everywhere we could put one, you know. I wanted one. Yeah. No doors yet. 
that's yeah. the next big thing is the builders chasing. Everybody's having, nobody got doors, yeah, nobody doors. or exterior doors. They're still waiting on them. Um, for, like I said, we, we got all windows in, but we don't have our big picture window. Yeah, so we're still waiting on the big picture window, but the way to keep things moving, I'm glad that they did it. I mean, we don't like the finished look. This one, this is okay. This is like a five by five window that they put in for now. Um, that way they can move forward, and then once we get the right window in, they can take it out. They still have the framing for it. Yeah. So we got all our windows in. Yeah. I'm glad. At least temporarily. We have them all in so we can move forward. And the builders are really excited. It's been so long since the house has been just sitting here. The background looks so good with, with the trees. Yeah. I love it. The neighbor's yard, like I said, that side we're definitely going to have to stick it up too. Because yeah. You, I mean, you can't hardly see here. It doesn't look like it, but you can clearly you can, just yeah, see it's right straight, through. But it's because we ain't got no, no leaves or nothing on nothing. Yeah. So hopefully that'll come too. We're inside. We're in our room. One of the things I noticed last time too, um, they asked us if we wanted it. Didn't even know what it was, but it's kind of cool. So you got this right here for uh, different inputs for your TV, for your HDMI. Uh, you got your cables that's gonna run there, but that way you have a spot over here. Boom. So say you have like something you gotta connect here like your computer, you can just plug it in here and it'll plug directly into the TV. We also have the same thing over here on the fireplace. They did the same thing for us, they put it Put a tube here and you can plug in right here. So say we have a cabinet, got TV sitting on it. We'll be able to run the cable right there and it'll go directly to the fireplace, to the TV. So yeah, nice neat little trick if you don't want cables running all over the place. These are the old tubs. These are the tubs we did not want. Mm -hmm. Yep, these are the ones we didn't want. They're in the middle of our great room because they got the right tubs in the house. Finally. I wonder where we're gonna get our, um our uh, freestanding tub. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, so we got still waiting on freestand tub. Haven't put that. That'll probably be at the end because that'll be after all the tile and stuff because it just sits on top. It's. Oh, okay. Yeah, that'll probably be way later. Oh, yeah, because you wouldn't want to do like the tubs where you're going to. Mm hmm. You're not going to tile around them. Yeah. And. So yeah, this is me in my tub. I'm in my tub right now. See, this is going to be me with the thing just oh, looking at the window, seeing the deer run around. Mm -hmm. Except way further down. Oh, wait, okay. Money's ain't made for that. All right, I'm yeah. going in the shower. Mm. Yeah, and that's the nice thing. They finished all of the plumbing up, getting it ready for the actual fixtures. Rain shower. Oh, yeah. Rain shower up there. Got a can light up there. So got the one shower head. So nice. Got our pocket doors for the bathroom and for the closet. So if we want to have it open, if we want to have it closed, this is our closet, my side, and then Curtis' side. That's all you Ooh, need, that's right? bigger than my closet. <laughs> if I get that, I'll be happy. Oh no. And then I think we're gonna do shelving in here, but that's something we're gonna probably have to like lay out with the builder so we know exactly what we want because I wanna make sure it's functional. Yeah. You know, so we can hang and have shelving. I don't know. Figure out what do. yeah, that's one of those assignments we're supposed to stay up late yeah. and actually do. This is the vanity area. So what I'm thinking is going to be a whole, you know, countertop. But we have mine, you have Curtis, and then here we have where I can sit and like if I want to have like a little mirror and do my makeup. I was thinking about maybe doing three mirrors right there. You know what I'm saying? Because we have sconces right here. I think we have sconces. Yeah. So we can put mirror, mirror, mirror if we wanted to. Yeah, obviously we still still trying to figure out exactly how we want to run it. All right, so we're gonna go upstairs real quick and show y'all the tubs. All right, so here we go. Check it out, y'all. We're going to the boys Jack and Jill. Yeah, and we got the same tubs in uh, in this room and in Aya's room. <sighs> yeah, so the big difference big is difference. really the shape of the front. See how flat it is? Big difference. It's just a clean shape. I mean, maybe we're being picky, but... No, you get what you want. We pay for what we want. Yeah, to us, that makes a difference. That makes a huge difference. It looks great. Oh, also, the way, the way the back is sloped, the other one was sloped more to about right yeah, here. Yeah, it had, like, more going on here. Like, it ain't different. All these angles, like, now. Yeah, watch. Wow. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. 
Yeah. His legs go all the way there, guys. Bro, that water's gonna be right here. Right here. Oh, yeah. It's gonna be soaking. It's gonna be nice. I can't wait. I love baths, by the way. Some people, they only take showers. If, if I got the opportunity to take a bath, like, probably every day, I probably take a bath every day. Soak in that little tub, yeah. Yeah. But yeah, so they got the tubs in, y'all. Which is awesome. Mm hmm. Um, that is it for what we got going on at the house. Also, guys, before we end, before we leave, I wanted to say we wanted plugs here, but I don't think we, um, we really paid attention to it because when we first, when they first did the framing, this part of the porch was not done. They thought it was going to be open, but no, I was like, this is supposed to be enclosed. Whenever we did the electrical walkthrough, I was like, I want a light here, and then I want a light on the outside. It's like, well, you don't have anything on the outside. And I'm like, well, it's supposed to be something on the outside. So then they looked at the um, blueprint, and sure enough, it was. So there's actually supposed to be a plug here. So if I wanted to do some decorations or something, I can easily light things up. I'm not sure if we want to do plugs like here and down there. So like if we were hanging Christmas lights or whatnot, I want it, you know, I don't want to have to worry about having long cords and all that good stuff. But um, yeah, so plugs there, plugs there. And if you haven't thought about that, you definitely want plugs in your soffit if you're building just because it's just gonna make things way easier, way smoother. And luckily my friend that I follow, Triple C Farmhouse on Instagram, reminded me about that because I completely forgot about it even though we told the builders about it like two or three times. But of course, you know, it, it even slipped my, slipped my mind. So I just have to make sure I let them know about that tomorrow. We finally made it back home. We had an awesome time hiking and had an awesome time going to the house. Like it's always, now that things are like really going into the house, it's exciting to go out there, especially seeing when things are done, like, you know, being done right and stuff like that. Um, yeah, it's pretty fun. What was I about to get ready to say? Oh, we end up stopping by my friend Julie's house. She has a farm. You guys know Faith Family Farm, I think it is. They come in a farm. She has a YouTube channel, so definitely check them out. But she's doing a lot of renovations on her house and it is coming along nicely. But the main reason we went over there is because they had a little baby calf that was born and the mom rejected it. So we went over there to see a baby calf. Never saw a baby calf before and it was just mooing and all that kind of stuff. So it was um, it was pretty cool to see. But yeah, we, what did you think, Boo? Uh, I'm glad, like I said, I'm glad things are going. Um, there are some things that we need to fix. We'll see how the rest of the process works. Yeah. I know that's why we go over there all the time. Definitely. You definitely have to. Yeah, everyone's right. Got to go there every day because you're going to yeah. find some stuff. You got to at least ask the question. And like I said, I definitely understand because they're taking on a lot of houses that they're building right now and mistakes are going to happen. But some mistakes I feel like, okay, they shouldn't happen because you have certain things on like the sheets and stuff. You mm -hmm. just have to follow, look, actually like look at it and don't just assume. But it's just, you know, it's good to just remind them because sometimes it's just an honest mistake. So that's what we're going to go do. Make sure there's no more mistakes that's going to delay anything because that's the biggest thing. I don't want to be yeah, delayed. Yeah, so far we haven't had anything huge where it's like a bunch of rework. Um, it was just like, well, yeah. it was sort of kind of. I don't know how, how the window is going to play out. We'll yeah. see. Oh, that's we're getting that window. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm saying Ain't I don't know what that. kind of delay it's going to cause. But I guess we'll know tomorrow. We'll update you guys the next time that we will vlog. But um, we're going to go ahead and end out the vlog today because we are tired and we want to get a little cozy time. Yeah. And yeah. don't forget, guys, if y'all want to be outdoorsy, um, oh gosh, yeah. consider LO being closed. They are, like I said, they got something for all temperatures to get you outside. So comfy. Like today we felt it was cool out. It was like, what, 60s? Yeah. And we felt warm. We did not feel cold. It it was amazing. I felt great. So guys, check the link in the description box. But for now, guys, we are going to end the vlog. Uh, what's your favorite line? I almost forgot it. Hmm? Like, comment, subscribe, and share. Don't, Don't forget to check out. Yeah, check out you Instagram get and TikTok. <laughs> Until next time, y'all. House update out. out. Thanks, LL Bean, for sponsoring today's video.